one night I was standing outside and it was the middle of the winter and I'm talking just dead, dead cold outside and somebody was playing hockey, you know, and, and you could hear that somebody was actually skating on ice and the whole thing. And, and I came around and here's this rink all lit up. And I, I mean, I, I'm from South Dakota. I, I've never seen anybody who had their own rink in their backyard. And it, you know, so I asked, I asked the kids playing on the rink, I was like, who built this, you know? And, and Lyndon, you know, told me that it was his father who had built it. And, uh, I, you know, it initially started with, look how neat this is. And then after we got to know the family a little bit and sitting down with them and just filming a few things to begin with, I realized that there was this much larger story behind this whole thing. When we, when we kind of got to learning about Thomas especially, like one of the things that really surprised me, and this is the truth, the man gets up at 4 o'clock in the morning and takes garbage cans of water out to out to this rink so that way the children when they get home from school can have fresh ice to play on i mean these people aren't just like building a hockey rink just to like have a hockey rink they're like they're really cool. using the rink to spread it in the community yeah so it really turned out to be one of these like you know originally just a puff piece for us to kind of like work on something and then it turned into like wow these people really do a lot for the community like how can we help them you know um, continue building this. Um, the next step is uh, we would like to get it submitted into film festivals. The, the film festival is just for visibility and to just you know say you know, we did something, uh, we made this film and here's a really cute family trying to do something locally and, and help kids. But everything else we want to go towards helping them continue evolving this rink.